All right, what's up everyone? Savage here. Um, I'm back uh, with a new video. Uh, got a very, very exciting new product. I mean, it's new for me, I guess. Um, but anyway, that is Tokyo Rose from the wonderful team at Phoenix Shaving. And this is just it's phenomenal. Great springtime, summertime scent. It's got, right the, right, so right out of the gate, you get, you get the rose and the cherry, but if you Sniff just a little harder, you can get, you know, oud, sandalwood, cardamom, just a couple of smaller notes of it, but all in all, this is a very uh, floral scent, but not a feminine, like, not overly feminine floral scent. It's a very neutral floral scent, and I love, I love a good floral scent. I don't know why. I used to not like them, but now I like them. It was all with, started with the Hunt of Sunny, Son of Honeysuckle last year. So we're going to keep this shave short. Uh... Huge shout out to my boy Dan S. Came in clutch with a uh, little care package he gave me. Uh, Dan, I just came back from a little bit of traveling, so I haven't actually had a chance to email you yet, but uh, I will email you in regards to the issue you were talking about, and we'll get that squared away. But, yeah, Dan came in absolutely fucking clutch with this one. It is nothing but love, Dan, nothing but love. If I'm ever in Ohio, I'm taking you out for a beer, my friend. I'm serious. All right. Hardware, software. So you saw the software, obviously. We're gonna go with the Solar Flare from Phoenix. I was gonna try to make this an all Phoenix shave, but I left my um, Ascension razor at work. So I'm gonna go with my Gillette Heritage with a Phoenix Platinum Strangler blade in it. Because that is like my favorite blade on the market as we speak. So we're just gonna bowl lather because uh, slight hurry. Gotta get to work. <clears throat> So this is my first time actually not buying the, uh, the CK6 formula from Phoenix. Uh, reason being, uh, you know, I just wanted to save a couple bucks. We'll just see if it was worth saving a couple bucks. I hope I did not make a goofball decision here. Let's go for a little bit more. But I have a couple older Phoenix products that are not CK6 and they lather just as well. So we'll see what happens. Oh yeah, nice. Brush lather. Oh. <laughs> Little soupy occasionally. Hope everyone is having a good start to their week. Uh, I'm just, my week is just beginning. Well, no, no, you know, I worked yesterday on a Sunday. Yeah, go figure. Welcome to the military, though. Still fighting the Korea problem. Might have a ace in the hole, not a good one, but it's there. Notification. Oh, Planet Lavender's back. I'm definitely going to snag that one on payday. I'm a dirty little slut for lavender, I'll say it. Okay, so, let's talk about this one. Especially because I've not bought a floral soap in a long time. Mainly buying lit ouds, you know, masculine style ones. But this one, it's got, under the nose, so... The, the the true show the, the true showman of this one are the cherry and the rose or cherry blossom and rose can't tell which one but it is I'd say it's about a good under the nose the scent got to be about a good I'd say about an eight, honestly. It was about a seven in the jar. It's because it had to be, you know, had to be, you know, really, you know, worked up and everything, agitated a little bit. So 
So far, so good though. I'm not seeing a notice, not feeling a noticeable difference between CK6 and their regular formula, but. Maybe the post shave feel will tell me otherwise. In case I was wondering, no, I still haven't found this ink stopper. I still just rocking a bowl in there. Don't care. It works. Let's uh, rehydrate that a little bit. And then we'll go for our second pass and probably our last pass. I really, really would like to do more than two passes, but like I said, run a little low on time here, but. So I've started doing something a little strange lately. I've been, uh, everyone knows me normally as a power lifter and a bodybuilder. Well, more a bodybuilder recently. I've kind of let power lifting go just because it's just harder in my body than bodybuilding is, I feel. But I've also started training for a 5K that's coming up. And normally, every, even people at work are stunned and shocked. Like, you're not a runner, dude. Well, I've been running. Matter of fact, I have a run scheduled today. A 30 minute easy pace run, you know, Monday, warm the joints up a little bit, get it ready for the other things, but I'm still doing my heavy lifting, but you know, I've been training for the run on the flight line, 5k out here in Virginia, It'll take place in the Williamsburg, Newport News International Airport, and it raise money for a, uh, for a children's hospital, I think, something to do with like a children's hospital or some kind of children's fund. So I'm gonna do that. Good challenge, a new challenge to set for myself. Without of anything, you know, helps raise money for kids. I'm, I'm all down, kids and veterans, I'm all down. I'm supposed to do a 5K the other week, but, or this past weekend, but uh, it turns out 5Ks aren't exactly cheap. No, I was gonna do a 10K. 10k or the 10k was like 60 bucks for registration and mm. all right against the grain of the lip let's see what it does oh that is so over initial so far my thoughts it is very slick, very, the glide is like nothing I've ever felt before. Well, for some reason, maybe just because I haven't used a Phoenix product in a minute, this one has, the glide is something, I don't, I don't know. Something, something about this one, it's, it's hitting different, I don't know why. Feels nice to get a good shave because yesterday was just a piss poor shave. I just lathered it up with some cremo. Namely, if you want to call it a lather, I mean. I'm going to do one more little bit of lather right here. Because that spot's being a little stubborn lately in my neck right there.
like that old mid shift tonight going at I gotta leave my house in like three minutes and work till 11 somehow I'll find time to put a run and some weightlifting and all that today but you know make it work always find a way find a way to make one right all right gonna rinse real quick bring my Lancaster Brushworks towel home from work so I'm going to use one of these weird things that my wife uses for her hair to hold it up it was very soft too <laughs> I'm such a douche <laughs> this thing's actually nice I'm not gonna lie <laughs> what don't judge me. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, cap this up a little bit. And if you know, you know, got a match, especially with a scent like that. Mm, 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 mm. Need to get one of the atomizers. Shaking shit, I'm gonna drop it one day. Oh. Yeah. Miss a tiny spot. Oh, this stuff right here. Absolutely no regrets about buying this stuff. It smells wonderful. The rose is the more prominent one in the aftershave. And the, the soap, the cherry, or the cherry blossom, whatever have you, is slightly more prominent, but the aftershave, the rose, really, for me personally, steals the show. And that's awesome because I. I think rose is a very, very lovely smell. It's, it's very subtle, which is why I like it. Alright. Oh, oh, that felt good. Alright. Overall thoughts on Tokyo Rose with Phoenix? Get it. Seriously. I'm not sure if it's limited or not. Just get it. You won't regret it. But that's all I have for you. Uh, shit, I'm behind now. But that's all I got for you. Hope you all enjoy your week and Savage signing out.